Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with a Kroger fill-in haul. Today is Wednesday, February 14th, so their new deals came out today. I found some great stuff and I wanted to share it with you all. So I'll start over here with the Honey Bunches of Oats. I grabbed two boxes. They were on sale, or are on sale, I should say, for $1.49 a box. I haven't bought cereal in a long time because we had so much, but I couldn't pass this up. My husband loves Honey Bunches of Oats, so I got him the vanilla flavor and then just the honey roasted flavor. I found some broccoli slaw on sale for a $1.52 a bag. And then I just got broccoli florets because we just eat a lot of broccoli and I like to have it on hand. I saw this, I think it's butoni, um, chicken parm ravioli. It was on sale for half price, so I'm gonna cook that up this week. And then I grabbed some of their Nature Valley oatmeal squares. Most of their Nature Valley products were on sale. Um, I think it was, I think they were, I can't remember. I think these were $4.99 each. And they also had other things on sale that you could kind of bundle together, like some of these Orita steak fries. So I think the steak fries were $2.99. And then if you bought three items, um, three participating items, then these were $4.99. I hope that makes sense. I know I'm kind of jumbling it up my speech a little bit, but these were $4.99 and these were $2.99, all different varieties of the Orita potatoes. And then the Bibigo was on sale, buy one, get one free. And I love Bibigo products. So I grabbed some bulgogi chicken dumplings and I've been wanting to try this orange chicken for a while. So I grabbed that. Um, I saw this and it was on sale for $3. They also had a truffle variety and then I think they had a bacon ranch variety too, but the original price was $3.99 and like I said, I got it for three bucks. I needed some more Parmesan cheese and normally I get Kraft, um, but this was sitting, sitting right next to the Kraft and I wanted to give it a try. I think this was about 50 cents more than Kraft, but again, I just wanted to try it out. Their Haagen-Dazs and Snickers and Twix ice cream bars were on sale for $2.99. So I grabbed two boxes of the Snickers and then my husband really likes the rum tres leche and I really like the honey salted caramel almond. I haven't bought ice cream in a long time, but this was a great deal at $2.99, you can't beat it. And then they also had their Johnsonville um, Cajun style breakfast sausage on sale, buy one, get one free. And this was the only product or only variety that was buy one, get one free. I think this is a limited time flavor and I wanted to give it a try. I'm just gonna pop these in my freezer. These were $4.99 each. And then another reason that I went to Kroger is because their Crest toothpaste was on sale for $2.99 for seven ounce. But I happened to be walking past the clearance aisle and I saw these 5.4 ounce um, boxes of Crest on sale for $1.40 each. So I thought that was a great deal. So I instead bought these uh, four boxes of Crest toothpaste on sale for $1.49. Also in the clearance section, I saw this Scotch gift wrap tape and it was $1.36 for three rolls. And then I have had this, I think I had this at Costco once as a sample and I thought it was pretty good, but I didn't buy it at Costco, but they had it here for $2.25. It's a parm crisp mix and it has almonds, parm crisp, cashews and pistachios. And then the Degree deodorant was on sale this week too, or is on sale this week too. I think these were, it was either $2.99 or $3.99, I can't remember. If you've been with our channel for a while, you know that for a while I switched to Native and I really liked it, but it kind of broke me out under my arms. And then I tried the Sensitive Native, but it didn't really work for me. So I'm back to Degree. And so I bought three um, tubes of this Degree deodorant. I got Pure Clean, and I also picked up Pure Rain and Shower Clean. I really like fresh scents. 
And then on an end cap, they had this Popcornopolis Nearly Naked Popcorn. Now, normally I buy Skinny Pop. I have had the flavored variety in this Popcornopolis, but I've never seen their Naked Popcorn. Pretty much has the same um, nutrition ingredients as a Skinny Pop, but this was on sale for, I think it was $1.49 a bag. So I grabbed two bags of the Naked Popcorn. So this is everything that I picked up on my quick fill-in haul. I think I spent um, in the low 80s. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. I didn't need any meat or fruits or anything like that or any other veggies. So this was simply a fill-in haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we'd love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.